The new iOS 15.4 just released by Apple includes enhanced face ID while wearing a mask. A very helpful feature while we are all still dealing with the COVID-19 pandemic. Additionally, Apple has added a second layer of security when accessing Apple Pay by requesting face ID recognition. The iOS 15.4 includes multiple and very important improvements. Let's take a deeper look into this new release. Okay, Leo here. Apple has released an update to its iOS 15 software following a beta process that began in late January. That means current iPhones will be able to install iOS 15.4 which also comes pre-installed on the new iPhone SE and the green iPhone 13 and the iPhone 13 Pro models. If you can run iOS 15 on your current iPhone, you will be able to use the iOS 15.4 update. That means any device including the iPhone 6S or later, as well as the latest generation of the iPod Touch and the iPad also. One of the most impacting features on the new iOS is the Face ID with mask. Now you can turn on a Face ID settings that let Apple's unlocking technology recognize your face even if you are wearing a mask. To get the feature up and running, head to Face ID and Passcode where there is now a toggle for using Face ID with mask on. Turn that on and you will be asked to scan your face again. After all that is set up, Face ID should unlock anytime you glance at the phone, even if you got a mask on. With iOS 15.4, Apple is adding a fifth Siri voice option for American users. You can check out the new voice by going to Siri and search in settings and selecting Siri voice. The new arrival is voice. Hi, I'm Siri. Choose the voice you'd like me to use. If you have used iOS 15, you probably already know about the live text feature that allows your phone's camera to capture text and paste it into other apps. There is now a scan text command in the pop-up menu that appears in either app. Then you select that and a camera window appears where you can capture text from a book, a notepad, or a photo. Just here, for example, we are capturing a text using the camera from the notepad and then we can paste this text into the notes app. The new iOS includes more than 30 new emoji options, adding symbols for beaten lips, beams, multiple face. This one, for example, like a, a melt, uh, you know, this happy face melt, a finger pointing you, I mean, multiple new emojis that exchange the communication using the text messaging and this new way to communicate in the world. You can easily store passwords on your iPhone, keeping them on the keychain for easy login. That is not new in iOS 15, but a note field is. Head to the password section of the setting app and you can type in notes about important passwords. But why to do this? Because those notes are also searchable within the password section. And sometimes it's easier to type in the name of what you are using the password for instead of remembering the name of the app or website that you want to log into. The air tag has also been upgraded and the associated Find My App features has arrived in this update. You now get a new pop-up when setting up an air attack to warn you that tracking someone without consent is a crime. And that victims and law enforcement can find you details via the attack when discovered. In addition, you can now no longer disable all warning notifications for unexpected air attacks in your vicinity. 
and other find my items will now be properly identified in this warnings rather than coming up with an unhelpful genetic alert. iOS 15.4 brings an important upgrade adding an emergency in SLS settings. That is the iOS feature that can call emergency contacts when you press down on one of the iPhone's volume button and the side button simultaneously. Tap on the emergency SOS prompt and you will see who your current contacts are with the chance to edit them and modify this um, information. The App Store has new notifications panel that lets you manage alerts for new features and updates and recommendations and offers. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Here you will find your favorite technology content. Be sure to subscribe. Click on any of these videos for more interesting information. Thank you for watching. See you guys the next time.